My name is Linda Whiting. I have been a fiber artist for many years, and now I am primarily a dyer and a tapestry weaver. Some wools come off the sheep and they are very soft and very fine. Some are much coarser and all of them have a grease. They have to be washed first. Some of them are bright white. Some of them are creamy colored. Some of them are natural brown or black or even a tan color. Wool right off the sheep can be commercially processed uh, or you can do it at home with hand carding and then um, spinning. And a lot of people do this today just because they prefer to have their own wool to use, whether they dye it or spin it. Some people collect their, their wool and send it out to a processor. And then it can come back either as roving ready to spin or they can make it into yarn, which then you can you know, use right away or you can dye, which is what I like to do with it. If I'm going to dye wool, First, you decide whether you want a solid color, which is done pretty much in one pot. But if you want multiple colors in, in your yarn, you lay it out in the pan. I will add the colors in bands. And then I can use the tools to manipulate the colors and uh, get things that, that would not be what you would find in a regular commercial yarn. You need heat and you need acid, which is a mild acid, which could be white vinegar, but I use citric acid because it doesn't smell. For hundreds of years, they used plant dyes and these would be gathered locally and they would cook those up and then put the wool in the pot with those plant dyes. And that would, they would have an additive which would secure the color to the wool. It's still being done today uh, by a lot of people that, that like the natural dyes because they feel like they are more soft in color rather than um, commercial dyes, which can be um, too bright for some people. I choose to dye my own yarns because that way I can create any color that I want, anything that is in my imagination. The same way a painter does not paint just with the colors that come in the tube, that they mix them on their palette. My pan or my pot is my palette. 